says, you shall bring from your dwelling two loaves of two tenths, or about eight cups, of an ephah. Now, he's saying, you're going to take these two loaves, and you're going to bring them, and they're going to be of fine flour. They shall be baked with leaven. Do you remember the teaching on um, Pentecost? We talked about how Jesus represented the unleavened bread that we take in communion that's a flat wafer, all right? And how it, it symbolizes the piercing of Christ. It's a prophetic vision and stripes that are laid on his back. Pentecost is different. It's two loaves. Is that because G Jesus took on our sin and now he's sinful? No. There's two of them. What do they represent? Us. In fact, they represent everyone. How do two loaves represent everyone? Because there's only two groups of people. Two equal groups of people on the planet. Jew, and if you're not a Jew, you're a Gentile. But here's what's so awesome about this Pentecost. He says, grab two loaves, make them of the same equal weight, and he says, take those two loaves, make them, one representing Jews, one representing Gentiles. Jesus' ministry, by the way, he said, I've come for the household of Israel. I came to speak just to the Jews. But out of what he said, the promise of the Father would come, and it would no longer just be to Jews. The Gentiles, you and I, those who are not Jews, would be, we've already always heard grafted in. No, no, not grafted in like we might have a little something going, you know, we might make it. No, no, he's saying, listen, they become equal. Now, you know what's so beautiful about equal? Because it's not about replacement the theology where we say, oh, we're going to replace the Jews. Off with the Jews, up with the Jesus. No, no. Jesus is the God of the Jews and the Gentiles. He's saying they're equally. He's saying you now are a partaker of the promises of Abraham. Everything God has promised to them, he now has made available to you because you now have an equal, not diminishing them in any way, not increasing yourself, but you've come in equal. Mm -hmm.